California. Like, hold on, let me fix my hair. Hello. I'm in California. So last night, the guy told me that um, I'm in East LA. But last night, y'all, I had the time of my fucking life. When I say to, oh my god, there's a little rush. Oh, should I go shopping? Yeah, let me go shopping. There's a nail spot. A bitch might want to just get her nails done. Oh, there's a Walgreens. I need safety pins. And there's a sneaker store. Yo, this, I live kind of, I live, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. When you got to run across in LA Street. I knew they was going to have one of these umbrellas. Look. And now I'm going to King Taco. So the taco spot you guys just seen me in, I got some hot sauce, I got two chicken tacos, I'm so excited, I took a bite, they're mad delicious. So then I got, I don't know, if they're the tacos, I don't know what the fuck this is. I got nachos too though, so, oh, that's a nacho, oh, I'm so excited. Areas 
you have that. And stop looking at other people and what they're doing and what they're not doing, but really look in the mirror at yourself and what you need to do for you. The energy will shift and your life will transform. Because like, I'm telling you, I mean, five years ago, I was not here. <laughs> I didn't know you and I didn't know all of you. So I'm, I just really, really encourage you to be shameless and to do. You really have to do and create. Don't just talk the talk. Um, just do and create work and you figure it out. You might fall on your face, you might fail, but that's fine. So long as you try to move on. Like the quicker you can fail, the quicker you can get on with your life and figure out what needs to happen. buy it was $20 this is do you boo and if you know her then you know like that's her saying and I had such an amazing time um hopefully you subscribe hopefully you guys see you guys see yourself in my video and I hope you guys like my channel um yeah it was amazing first time in LA is amazing and I'm so happy and so blessed that I could take this trip yeah, and just chase your dreams. That's what I keep saying. If you follow me on Snapchat and Instagram, I've been posting on both of my stories. Like, I just keep saying, like, chase your dreams. Chase your dreams. Like, because while I'm out here, I'm just doing nothing but chasing my dreams. And it just feels so good. And I just really want you guys to do it because I feel like if you're scared or nervous about something, you need to just get up and you just need to go and do it. Chase your dream because at the end of the day, no one's going to put food in your mouth for you. If you're hungry and you're hungry for something, go fucking eat. Go go get because if you hung, if you broke, you're not going to sit in the house and stay broke, right? I mean, I hope not. You're going to go out and you're going to get your money. You're going to get your coin. So if you're, you want your dream, so say, I want YouTube to be my job. Like, that is what I want. This shit... I enjoy doing this. It's a passion. It became a passion. It became a love. I'm about to cry. Such a baby. It became a passion and a love and a journey because not only am I meeting new people and I'm seeing a whole different light to the world, it gives me something to look forward for to before I felt no, I didn't feel pointless, but I felt like I don't have a purpose in this world. And now my purpose is YouTube. Like I don't know it sounds so dumb, but like my purpose is YouTube now like it gives me a sense and a something to live for like it's just just so happy and I'm so blessed that I was able to come here and thank you to everyone who has helped me come this far shout out to my mom I'm giving a little shout out speech <laughs> shout out to my mom who always got my back you a real one. You smart. Loyal. Yeah, but shout out to everyone who's making my dreams become reality. It doesn't go unnoticed and it will definitely be worth it. I came to this place called the Shrimp Mother. It's really 